<laughs> yeah, I think, you know, it always seems great and yet we see the cases where it doesn't work and we try and make those cases work better. And as we make those cases work better, people start asking more of those questions and then uh, we see more cases. That, yeah. So I would say the future search has three axes to it, the way we think about it. The first axis is intelligence. Search is going to get more and more intelligent. The biggest aspect of this is language understanding. So, like I said, GM cars GM versus GM crops. A second aspect, uh, you know, you can also do other examples are, you know, CS courses versus CS soccer. One is Counter-Strike because some soccer team, CS is otherwise computer science. And we understand those sorts of differences. But there's a long ways to go over there because there are much more sophisticated things that human beings can understand, but the computer can't yet.